like for me when I'm so far from my family and friends, it's just like so important. I really, really am glad I'm here. <laughs> I am oh, 21 years old, uh, I'm from the Czech Republic and I'm an au pair in the United States. So I grew up in a little town like hour and a half from Prague. I was always used to do so many activities like gymnastic, belly, horseback riding, like I was horseback riding for like nine, ten years, even more, I don't, I st stop counting. <laughs> Then I was doing mountain biking for quite a, quite a while. I tried triathlon, yeah, I played violin, and then yeah, I was always around every sport because my mom, she always took me on like sport vacation or like do new sports, try new things, yeah. I was really upset always that we always went to a, like on a summer vacation, we always went to Austria to ride the mountain bikes instead of like going all inclusive to a hotel somewhere. But now I'm really, really happy that she did that because it would be so much boring. Like it would be so boring. And how did you find CrossFit? I actually really don't know. I mean, I was all like, since I was, I think 15, 16, it like started to go to the gym and then try that with my friend from back home. And she tried CrossFit once in like our gym back home. But I was like, I don't know. Then I tried it, but it was more like Tabata where mostly like body weight stuff. When I went to uh, for work for an au pair job to Mallorca, Spain, I was following one girl from Instagram. She was really positive and she was doing CrossFit. She started in the US where she was for like work and travel stuff. And I was like, yeah, I should try that. It looks fun. And like, I mean, I like this. I don't like gym anymore that much because they're like people and like they're really I don't know, just, it's just about like, it's not a group of people, it's not a community. So there I find a job, a uh, job, box. What did you like about CrossFit compared to the regular one? The high intensity in it, like it's really high intensity and you need to get like all out, usually like you, or you want to. And then like the people who are like cheering, cheering on each other and that there is always someone who you can ask like if you're doing these things great and or and if not and like if you don't feel comfortable with something you can always like change it for another thing or like easier version of the thing and no mirrors that's awesome <laughs> because then people are like lo looking to the mirrors and like not really paying attention to themselves and so you did cross it in spain mm -hmm. how long was that for oh i think it was like two three months and then I figured I want to go somewhere else <laughs> so I went here and before it was so funny in the process of looking for a family you like get messages and stuff so I always when I get a message from a family I always search up a box nearby and like look okay this looks good oh they, yeah this looks really nice <laughs> so I was in touch with this with my current host family for like month before I left and I was already following Kana <laughs> on Instagram. Then I found, like I was talking to my host parents and I told them where CrossFit Kana is and then some other boxes and they were like, oh, that's really near. Like you can even like walk there or like run there. I was like, whoa, really? Yeah, so. So talk about your experience here. You know, someone saw you on the street, someone saw you at the mall or something saw across the um, and they were like, what's that? What would you say? Do people already know CrossFit? It's like, I would definitely say that it's the best community you can get because it's, I, for me, it's really a big part of it. And then like the coaches are really, really great because there is, there are so many options of scaling stuff and like you don't need to be worried about like if you're not good enough if you don't feel comfortable with something, if you're injured or something, they will always make sure you will be safe and like doing things right and just not be scared and try. 
when I come and I don't really have a great day because something happened and I come here and like the people are just like really really nice and always like asking what's wrong what's going on or like even it's if it's everything okay they even ask like what's going on with you where you gonna travel again with me <laughs> and then at the workouts they always like cheer or, or on each other and like helping with something and even like when we are not in CrossFit I'm in touch with some people like going to the movies <laughs> like for me when I'm so far from my family and friends it's just like so important I really really am glad I'm here <laughs> I think for the people that don't know CrossFit it's good if they would come like in the middle of workout or something because it's really nice to see how the people are like really really they are not competing they are not making fun of each other like oh you cannot lift 200 pounds so and more, more a lot of people i think thinks that crossfit could be like that like people can be like not nice but this is not this case i don't know we need a you need a dog here <laughs> there always need to be a dog <laughs> I mean, Connor is <laughs> more like monkey. Yeah. <laughs>